Okay, so let's take a look at defending the guillotine from the guard position. All right, I'm in my opponent's guard. There's a, a few ways for him to set up the guillotine from this position. He is actually going to set it up by faking the kimura and then reaching over for the guillotine. Okay, so he's gonna break me down, set up for the kimura. But instead of attacking that arm, he's looking to fall back and reach through and attack the guillotine, okay? It's my job, the moment that I feel him transition from my arm to my neck to reach up and grab his wrist and be prepared to reach my other arm over. I actually have to clear his shoulder before his back falls back and connects to the ground. Okay, so let's do it one more time. As he sits up and I feel him reaching, even before this, I need to focus on my other arm reaching over. So the key is to come over the top and connect to the wrist as he falls. From here, I step up on the side of the, ar of the arm that's over. This hand wants to be deep through on the back. Okay, I can use this leg to drive pressure with my shoulder into his neck to make it uncomfortable. Once I'm putting pressure, I'm keeping a hold of this, but I'm swimming my elbow inside of the leg. And I can use that to now start breaking the leg through. Once that comes, once I break this knee through, I can actually let this go to use it as a post for balance. I'm somewhat safe at this point. I'm still blocking this leg with my foot. So even though my knee came over, my foot is still on the leg. I'm now going to step out. And as I clear this leg out, I want to get back control of the wrist. My foot can come off, my knee can come up. Now I can look up behind me and turn the corner. I can push and trap the arm to find myself back into a head arm triangle, which I believe we've worked on before, but we'll go ahead and finish it by lifting the head, rebiting a deep grip, connecting my bicep and my elbow, and then compressing to finish. Really important guys, do not roll your opponent. Keep them flat on their back as you're, as you're driving and squeezing and compressing in, okay? Let's look at it one more time from a different angle. he comes through I come over step up I'm gonna swim my elbow inside to break I can step out step behind as before or slide my knee through to step out now I can look away to trap I always want to lift and re-bite deeper. Some people like to go here. I like to grab the bicep and my elbow. Keeping him flat, I can now compress and drive my head in to get the head arm triangle. Thanks for watching and make sure you like and subscribe and leave a comment below.